Hi guys, I hope you're all well. We have just arrived in Martinal Chiado, which is the second part of our trip with Martinal. Um, so if you watched my last video, you'll know that we were staying in Cascais, in the Martinal Resort Hotel there. Um, so we were there for two days. I'll leave a link to that video below. That's more kind of out in the country, about 45 minutes away from the city centre of Lisbon, which is where we are now. I'm here with Jasper. He's very grumpy and tired, so I'm gonna wrap this up. Uh, we're here for two days um, just to explore. So we might go to Sintra tomorrow because it's meant to be beautiful if the weather is nice, but it has been raining. Um, but yeah, it's about six o'clock. We're gonna order room service, maybe check out the kids club cinema night. I forgot as well, I'm gonna give you guys a tour before we unpack our things. Um, so this is the door, obviously. And this is the hallway. So it's a whole apartment as opposed to a hotel room, which is what we had in the other hotel. Beautiful rug. Hooks on the walls. It's very kind of like, I want to say art deco-y, modern. I don't know if that's the right term, but that's what I think it's like. Um, so in here, we've got two bunk beds. So this is where Jasper should sleep, but he's going to sleep with me. And they had this in the other hotel as well. Some little kiddie flip-flops and a kiddie bathrobe. Double wardrobe there little chair and the lamp and then this is storage in here little mirror me after a long day I look very dishevelled um, and then in here we have got the living room just was eating the cookies that were here so we've got two really gorgeous big tall windows um, and these are locked if you want the key to open them you have to get it from reception which I think is brilliant because obviously with kids safety so we've got TV it's a nice big space iPad is charging um, and then we've got the kitchen uh, there's a dishwasher a washer and dryer which is good because we had a couple of accidents on the plane on the way out here um, and it's nice to go back with clean clothes um, all of this was included dinosaur biscuits Jasper's got cookies and then just like milk and orange juice and water and stuff some wine um, and then back out here we have another lovely rug and then we've got my bedroom and Jasper's bedroom <laughs> and then the bathroom and what's really good is they've got like a potty and have they got steps in this one yep steps there as well um, for kids so they're so child friendly so we've got the bath the sink all the products that they use are Voya uh, which are all organic and smell amazing and then my wardrobe there so really lovely. It's very different decor compared to the Kashkaish one. Kashkaish was very, um, like everything was very white and very spa-like, um, whereas this is more kind of modern, artsy, very like city. And I love both of those styles. So yeah, really excited to spend a couple of days here. So I've just had my tortellini delivered, which looks delicious. We're going with Kerry and her mum. Kerry vlogs at Kerry Conway. It's a 40 minute train journey away. We need to have breakfast first. So I'm just having a cup of tea. I'm gonna get dressed. And then as soon as he's up, we'll go have breakfast and head off to Sintra. It's nine o'clock, I am ready and he's still asleep. <laughs> I don't think this has ever, ever happened. But, um, yeah, I've just got my little, I don't even know what you call it, like a onesie on. It's a strappy one, but I think it's going to be cold today, so I've put a long sleeve top on underneath. But yeah, I'm just going to pot around. I think Kerry and her mum are going down for breakfast now. So yeah, hopefully we're not going to delay everyone too much. I just don't want to wake him up because I think he'll be grumpy and he's not going to sleep much longer. I hope. <laughs> Look who's woken up! My happy boy! <laughs> Good morning! What are we doing today? We're going for adventure. We're going on an adventure, yeah! So my washing machine isn't working in the room, so I've taken my washing down to reception for them to do. And my hair's a bit greasy, so I've got my headband on. 
You can wear them later if it gets warm. It's obsessed with wearing shorts, but it is so cold today. in Sintra we ended up missing two trains because we went to the metro stations at the train station and then the queue was so long and we got the wrong tickets and then we finally got here waited for a bus missed one bus got the second bus and we didn't realize how long the bus journey was I felt so sick it's all the way to the top of like really really windy roads up yeah down. all the way up to here but yeah we're here and our first stop is the Castello de Moros Moros Castle yeah we're gonna go and explore yeah. got these two here <laughs> Things we have to do can wait We've got catching up to do There's a glow about you This is a perfect time to catch a cold Turn the full length up on your shore Stay up for the summer, speak a wish There is no way we'll be forgetting this Take a long walk till we start to freeze here in small talk over the summer breeze out of safe songs finding hidden caves all the wet stones shaped by the ocean waves it's a night so we have now come to our second stop which is the palace of penna um, which if you've ever seen pictures of Sintra it's like the colorful castle like my headband's on a bit funny. Yeah, it's all the really colourful like pink and yellow and blue castle palace buildings and it looks absolutely beautiful. It's like 525 metres from here, which is the entrance um, and we've already walked like, I don't know, we've been walking a long time. <laughs> from the palace. Did you like it, bud? Yeah, baby. What was up there? Uh, How beautiful it is. Uh, colours. Colours? Colours. Colours. And what did we have to walk over? A drawbridge. A drawbridge that the knights would have closed if anyone invaded. Yeah. Super if, cool. If they tried to break in, <laughs> they close it quickly. Yeah. With the arms. Yeah, and now we're gonna walk down the thousand meters. I feel like, but I think we've done quite well. Kerry's, how many weeks pregnant are you? Twenty-six. Twenty-six weeks pregnant. We've got a four-year-old, and then Kerry's mum has a walking stick. So I think for all of the walking we've done, we've done quite well. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we have just gotten back to the hotel. Such a lovely day. Sintra is my new favourite place in the world. It's so, so beautiful. It's like a fairy tale, magical. Like when you go up to the palace, it looks like Disneyland, but without the like Disney characters and touristy vibe. It's, well, obviously it is touristy, but it's just not like 
I don't know, it's not an attraction, it is an attraction, but yeah, it's just amazing. I absolutely love it. I wanna go back because there's so much more to do there. But yeah, we've just got back to the hotel and we've been moved rooms because our washing machine wouldn't work um, and the toilet wouldn't work in the morning, um, which I think is really rare for a place like this. I just think we got really unlucky. So they did our washing for us and that's all like, neatly folded here literally as soon as we turned up they had it ready and this room look at it so apparently it is the same size and the same like for the same amount of people and everything it's just a different layout um but yeah you come in and you've got a nice little desk area the two single beds which i think that's what makes it look so much bigger because the other one was bunk beds um nice little seating area actually they've brought everything up um huge sofa there kitchen area so it's more like a kitchen diner rather than like a separate living room um and then here jasper's just playing with the b-day but the bathroom's bigger as well and the wardrobes and then the main bedroom which again i feel like is bigger but it might not be yeah it's got the built-in wardrobes and then we're a little bit higher this time we're like floor four i can't open the windows again because um like safety but yeah, you can just see the sea right there. But yes, we had dinner at Pizza Hut just before we got the train because we had to wait an hour for the train. So I think we're just gonna have a bath and an early night because we leave tomorrow morning. so it is our last morning uh, we don't even really have a full morning because we're leaving i think we're getting picked up at 9 55 jasper is just kind of slowly waking up and yeah we're going to go down for breakfast in a minute and then i think we might quickly run down to pink street because i really want to get a picture there it's actually known for the strip clubs um but the whole pavement is pink so I want to get a picture for the floor. Then yeah, it'll be time to get picked up. Right, we are just going down for breakfast. I've not done my hair yet. And Jasper is going down in his pyjamas. Which is absolutely fine. <laughs> I put it in You've got to pick your battles, haven't you? So that's our room there. And this is the hallway. It's very nice decor, isn't it, bud? No, no, I want to go see Kelly now. You want to go see Kerry? He's probably had breakfast and gone out exploring now. That's my shoes. Don't my shoes. You said you didn't want to wear your shoes. I I want to wear my shoes now. Come on then. What's really good about this is you have to show your card on here before you can press the button, and it means that kiddies can't just press buttons and go anywhere. and we're just quickly walking to the pharmacy. Then we're gonna walk down to Pink Street, aren't we? So yeah, he wanted to sit on the iPad, well, sit with the iPad. So I could have left him in the kids club, because you can do that, you don't have to, well, you do book them in when it's busy, but if they're free, you can literally just, I could have dropped him in for like 20 minutes while I quickly ran to the shop. But yeah, that's a really, really good thing about the Martinal hotels, is that if you're staying there, you get childcare free all day, and they also do like a kids, um, cinema night and mini disco every night they have one or the other and even if you're staying at the Martinal Qashqais if you come into Lisbon just for the day like to do some shopping as long as they've got space you can also drop the kids in so you don't actually have to be staying at that particular one um, as long as you're staying at another Martinal one at the time so I think that's just brilliant <laughs> We are done with nine minutes to spare. <laughs> For drinks. 